Aha. Get that beaver's name and address. And I see a great blue heron. Lots of uh, lots of goose poop here. It's one of the reasons why I didn't walk this way last week when it was dark. So I'm hearing it, I'm definitely hearing a Viri singing. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, right inside. It's inside the, the uh, how do you get your, how do you find your way in there? There's one inside. Huh. 
How did you get in there? Are you trapped in there? Are you trapped in there? <laughs> you just don't understand. We are going to stop this water flow. Leave it here. I just, I've got to see what you guys are saying. <laughs> This is ridiculous. Hold on, I'm gonna move. Now, the, just, you know, some of you may not know, but this barrier, this fencing was put up to help protect against things, and it's uh, also, a, now they've changed things in the last uh, couple years, but they, um, they had put in a mitigation effort years ago to uh, actually draw the water out of the pond, this is the outflow area, uh, to have it flow uh, out of the pond from actually deeper out there in the water. And the theory is, and the whole, the way it works is the beavers, first of all, oh, even if they try to block things up, the water will still have a way out, for one. And two, uh, there's less of the a, of a sound of water they can they could cover this all up all they want and maybe that is still in place and they're still hearing it and they're trying to block things but i don't know did it swim through the pipe is that how it got in there We won't be here too much longer, but... You know, and... A part of me is glad to see this. I'm, I'm just glad to see that the beavers are, are managing to be victorious. But another part of me is worried that, okay, maybe... They'll... I, I can't imagine that the lab would do anything to harm them, but... 
it just went through the pipe. At least I think it did. I think it just entered the pipe. So, uh... No, it's... I think it's still in here. Yeah, you can... S okay. So this is a, a two-pronged attack, one from outside of the, uh, the area, and one from within. I just hope it can find its way out eventually. But it found its way in, they're not... Yeah, I'm sure it can... well, I'm not sure. I hope it'll find its way out. Anyway, we're gonna move on. One more look at the great blue heron, which is using the former heron tree. Hold on, I'm hearing noise. I do wonder if maybe, possibly, it's stuck in there. I mean, I know it's con continuing to do its work, but I wonder if it can't find its way back out. You can hear it. Like it's, it's, um, it's doing something, you can hear. I think you can hear it. It's like it's making contact with the with the pipe. Maybe it's scraping around it or something? I don't know. And its claws uh, are touching it. I... Hold on, I gotta... Okay, it's a little after eight. We don't have much time. But I can't get myself to leave either. <laughs> Okay, we are gonna get going though. Interesting, I wish the beavers well. I wish everybody well, actually.